Hi everyone, many Vietnamese students want to study in the US, especially about the high school program. But many most of them don't know what is the best school in the US. So today, we are Dr. Yu Corporation. Would like to introduce you to meet the representative of Kissy School to know more about this school. Uh, so, uh, hello, sir. Would you introduce us something about your school? Sure, so Kiski is uh, the oldest all-boys school in America, founded in 1888. It's a great place um, for boys to go and be engaged in the classroom. Uh, a lot of hands-on activities that uh, really teach boys and engage boys in a way they're not getting in a co-ed environment. So, um, what grade does student can study in your school? So Kiski starts in the ninth grade and goes up through the 12th grade. Mm -hmm. So how about the location of your school in the U.S.? Sure, so Kiski is located in the northeastern part of the U.S. Um, we're in Pennsylvania, really ideal location. Um, we're near the large city of Pittsburgh, um, which means we have all the benefits of that. Um, however, uh, we're far, just, just a little bit outside the city, which means we can have a very large, um, safe campus that includes a lot of um, amenities that students like, such as a golf course on campus, um, lots of big, big classroom space, um, spread out dormitories, swimming pool, um, tennis courts, golf court, uh, I'm sorry, uh, basketball courts, and a student center that has everything a student can imagine from uh, you know, uh, table tennis to air hockey to television. So how is the weather in this place? Sure, so it depends on the time of the year. One of the cool things about uh, where Kiski is is you get different weather in each season. We get all four seasons at Kiski. So um, in the uh, fall when school starts, it's very warm. Um, in the winter, uh, midway through the year, it gets to be cooler, and then um, in January and February, we'll get uh, a good bit of snow, and then in the spring, it warms back up. Would you tell me why uh, the international student would choose your school to study? Sure. Um, Kiski is a perfect place for an international student for a few reasons. Um, one being Kiski is almost all boarding. So we are 96% of the students who go to Kiski live at Kiski. Um, that means the students get a really special um, treatment that you don't get otherwise. So for example, you come over to Kiski, you get an American roommate, which helps you pick up um, parts of the English language that you otherwise can't get in the classroom. Um, you get an environment where it doesn't end at night, it doesn't end when the classes are over. All of the teachers but two live on campus. So we're able to provide extra help during study hall that everyone participates in at night. So if a boy's having some language issues, he can just go knock on his teacher's door and get some help. Um, it also means on the weekends and evenings, later in the evenings, there's a lot to do, a lot of entertainment. Um, sometimes it's educational, sometimes we're working on leadership skills and um, things like that. Sometimes it's fun going into Pittsburgh, going to Washington, D.C. Um, you know, uh, uh, going on a ski trip, uh, going out to dinner and a movie, endless options. Yeah. So it's that interesting. <laughs> it is, and one other benefit to Kiski for international students is um, we maintain a low number of international students. So at any given time, we're around 20% international, which is significantly lower um, by design than a lot of uh, other boarding schools. Um, Yet, while we're doing that, we maintain all of the services that international students need, such as ESL, an international student program team, to help with visa needs, cultural needs, um, uh, transportation needs, all that. Yes. Yeah. Do your school attract many international students all over the world? We do. Mm -hmm. We do. So, um, we have uh, international students from about 14 different countries. Um, everywhere from you know Europe to Asia to North America to South America um, all over and then also within the United States um, we have students from from all over from the East Coast West Coast um, southern parts of the country like uh, Louisiana and, and northern parts uh, like Connecticut how about the accommodation for students? Do your school have dormitory for international students? 
We, we do, but the dorm for international students is not separate. Yes. So they would share a dormitory with American students. So every international student who comes over is guaranteed an American roommate. Mm -hmm. So how about the inside of the dormitory? Sure. So in the past 10 years, Kiski has done $25 million um, U.S. dollars worth of campus upgrades. And one of the big focuses has been dormitories. Um, so the inside of the dormitories are very nice. Um, each dormitory has one to two day rooms, which is a recreational area for the students. Um, they have a kitchen uh, and a laundry room. And then each dorm room has two beds, so one student um, or two students per dorm room. Um, and then they're furnished with you know the bed, the desk, the chair, the dresser, all that stuff. Sarah, I would like to know more about the facility of your school. Sure. So again, that's um, one of the nice parts about Kiski. I uh, just mentioned it, but $25 million in upgrades over the past 10 years. Um, uh, a few examples of what we done, have done is we recently opened our new um, athletic center, um, which is a big hit. Uh, we've built a new student center on campus, which I, I talked previously a little bit about what that includes. We've updated um, most of our dorms. Um, we're about to update our dining hall. We've redone the entrance to campus. Um, we've got a, a recently updated library um, and academic building. We just built a new maker space, um, which really ties in well with boy learning. Um, it's got uh, a lot of advanced technology, sprout computers, 3D printers, laser cutters. Um, a separate room uh, that's designed for, um, you know, film, film editing. Um, it's got a green screen and uh, a lot of advanced technology in there. Yes. So how about the extra activity that your school offer to students? Uh, another really strong point at Kiski, um, we offer 12 different sports um, and then 30 different clubs and extracurriculars that students can sign up for. Um, international students really thrive at Kiski when they come uh, get heavily involved in what we have going on. So um, we're pushing students to get involved in athletics or sports, or I'm sorry, or um, you know something in the arts, maybe maybe music. Um, and what we see is when international students get mixed in with these extracurriculars that have high achieving. American students, um, they become a part of that too, and they, they really do well with that. Uh, so the last question I would like to ask you that for the international student that's the first time come to your school, do you have any advice for them to study well at your school? I do, and it's back to kind of what I just said, um, get involved. Do as much as you can um, to be a part of as much as you can. So of course, um, you want to study hard, study smart. One of the things we do at Kiski is teach boys not just to study, but how to study, how to manage your time, all of the how to be organized, all those important study skills. Um, but getting involved is big too, becoming a leader. Um, all of those great things kind of stem from immersing yourself in the environment, um, the local environment, and uh, being involved in as much as you can. So thank you so much for your sharing. Uh, thank you so much for your listening. And if you need for information about this school, please feel free to contact us.